Right, so in today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to fix the problem where iTunes on your Windows computer is not recognizing your iPhone. So you've launched iTunes, you've connected your iPhone, just like I'm going to do just now. There you go, connected. But iTunes does not pick up the iPhone. Okay, so you can even see uh, my Apple iPhone has been detected by Windows but iTunes, for some reason, is not picking up the iPhone. So how do you fix this problem? Now, the main solution and the number one solution for this is installing the new Apple devices application. So Apple is trying to move away from iTunes and they want you to use Apple devices. And this app is available in the Microsoft Store. So if you go into Microsoft Store on your Windows computer And then go to the search function at the top and look for Apple devices. You should see the new app. Okay, so this app right here. So go ahead and install this app from the Microsoft Store. As you can see, I've already installed it. And once you install it, that's the app Apple wants you to use. So just go ahead and launch Apple devices since mine is already installed. There it is. And when you launch it and connect your iPhone, it's gonna get detected. So let's go ahead and unplug the iPhone and then plug it back in. Actually, it was already detected, so let's wait for it to load up. Of course, you may be asked to, if you trust this device. And that's what it's gonna look like. So you can see my iPhone has been detected here, including the storage space. We have the general section, and then you have music, movies, TV shows, just like it was on iTunes. So this is the app Apple wants you to use. It's the official new Apple devices application. So this is where you can obviously back up your computer, you can restore, I mean, your iPhone. Uh, you can restore, you can update, you can do stuff, all right? So that's one way of fixing that problem. Just go ahead and install the new Apple devices application. Now, something else you could do in case you've uh, set up this application and it's still not connecting is to check the cable. So just make sure you're using a proper data cable. You might even want to try a different cable and see if that's going to work. Sometimes you might have a cable that's just a charging cable and not a data transfer cable. So make sure you get the right cable and of course the right ad adapters, depending on your port situation, get the right adapters. Another thing you can do is to check or even change the USB port on you're using on your computer. So first of all, check that that USB port is actually working. You can unplug your iPhone, try something else like a flash disk or a hard drive and see if it works. And then you can change the port if you need to. And then the other thing you can do to fix that problem is to probably restart your iPhone and also restart your computer. Okay, so just restart both devices and try to connect again and see if that works. But the main solution is definitely the Apple devices app. That's the new app Apple wants you to use to connect your iPhone to your Windows PC or laptop. All right, so I hope this was useful. Thanks for watching. If you found this video useful, don't forget to leave a like possibly even subscribe for more tips. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them down in the comment section and we'll chat, we'll hang around there for a while and we can chat or I will talk to you in the next one. Good luck.